<laughs> okay. F funny spook. And yeah, why are they funny? Hmm. Okay. Well. All right. Oh, oh, that's the murderer guy. So he's over here, huh? Ooh, awesome. Awesome. I want to save it this time, right now. Cool, I hope I find him. That's a big thing. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Nothing is more important than family. <laughs> I love that voice acting. Uh huh. Oh, I see. Hmm. So maybe his family got killed and he became a crazy guy who raises the, his dead family. It's kind of interesting. <laughs> Ooh. So he's a, he's a follower of Bane, or at least he was. Bane's dead at the moment, though, I think. Comes back in 3rd edition. Spoilers! Sorry. Uh-huh. Yeah. Let's call, call out. Why not? Got a nice little ring here. Hmm. Okay. You should come along quietly. Yeah, I'm sure that will work. I'm sure that will entirely work. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> That's so lame. Oh, yeah, let's play along. I don't think I have the charisma to do this, though. Yeah, he's nuts. Hmm. Yep. Well, it's a good thing he's playing along with the delusion, huh? Wait. Oh, oh, we're caught. Uh huh. Sorry, uh, sorry for the quiet. I I'm trying to read. Well, hmm. This sounds very lawful. Good, sort of, or at least lawful. Okay. Well, I guess I'll just say this. Okay. Whatever. Oh wow. That was easy. I mean, obviously, we, I, I thought we had to fight all these guys. That would have been a lot tougher. Wow, this guy is kind of a pushover, actually. As long as he doesn't do uber spell that kills us instantly or something. Whatever he was doing, it failed. Lucky us. Uh-oh. Oh, not, not this. Damn it. Oh, well. Hey, good job. Kali got a ding. Nice. Let's grab this stuff and then get the hell out of here. Ooh. Oh, he follows, uh... Cyric. Cyric. Yeah, that's the symbol of Cyric. For certain. Ooh, lots of nice armor and stuff. Ooh, and, and I have top of my the ability for hammers, don't I? I think I do. Everyone, get out of there. Go. Wait, when did he get brought back to life? I thought he killed all the zombies and stuff. Well. <laughs> Sorry, Khalid, you're kind of stuck there. Meanwhile, let's do your level up. Yeah, he's entangled. Oh, well. Okay, what kind of weapon is he using at the moment? Can I check? Oh, I can't exit out of this? Okay, I can. Good. I don't want to, like, screw it up because I'd exited out of it or something. Okay, you've got a long sword, so I may as well level that up, right? May as well. I don't foresee you getting a, an axe anytime soon. Oh, I don't even have any skills to put in there. Never mind, then. I was been, I's been misled. Alright. Well, that was very hands-off, but... Okay. What's my reputation? 
Instead of a his was, but oh, I've got the same one. Popular. Cool. Well, all good then. Seems like it's not too hard to stay in good graces, really. Yeah. What are you waiting? We're all any, here. Boss? All good. Sweet. Yeah. Now we can go do that quest. Once we uh, talk to the zombie. Okay. Once we kill the zombie. I will show you justice. Just in, you know, in case. Ooh, experience points. Yes. I wish we had all these guys still alive and they just stand there while we killed them. <laughs> 65 experience points apiece? Yes. Yes, please. That'd be delicious. Mmm, so delicious. Is there going to be anything here besides what just crossbows? What? You mean skeletons don't have pockets to carry gold in? Where I feel gypped. Okay, so we can go back and talk to the paladin, at least. And maybe other things, too. I don't remember what, though. I'll have to check my journal. After I finish looking around here. Oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh. We got some AI who are actually, or some undead who are actually fighting here. Don't you hit Imowen, you jerk. Come on. Wow. We're pretty effective, actually. What? What's the 5 minus 2? Th oh, I get it. Because they, the skeletons must have, like, damage reduction or something. That must be it. Yeah, cool. I'll get right on that. Well, that went really well. And we can just go right down to Nashville from here, huh? Oh, wait, never mind. To that. Well, as usual, we're going to go to the new place and then turn back. Ooh. Oh, is this half, half Ogre Band that we heard about? Ooh, there's uh, quite a lot of them. And you don't have much to do here, so stay back. Uh-huh. Maybe that wasn't the best thing. I suppose you could heal him or something, could you? Yeah, you've got Cure, so cure him. Silly AI. Do it! Fast! Fast! Okay, good. Should we focus our attacks? I assume so. Seems wise. Ooh, um, one of us should have... Actually, I have... Turn on dead. I'm not sure if it'll do anything, though. May as well turn it on, though. Well, I guess it got, just got turned off again, didn't it? Whatever. So is this that band of half ogres that we heard about? Because it's weird that they'd be right there. I'm guessing though there's more to it than just that. Wow, they cannot hit um Rasad, can they? Top of my to do. Sorry, I just I always forget names. I'm terrible with names. Bucklers, yeah. Well, no wonder we kicked their asses. All they got is bucklers and warhammers. Not exactly the best arsenal, is it? Ooh, hello. I'll take that gold. Nice. Well, I think it's time to turn back. <laughs> that went well, though. Very well. I think I should rest. Yeah, why not? Oh, no, no, not this. This kind of rest. Alright. Yeah, I'll get right on that. We're all good then? Yes? I hope so. Um. Oh, there she is. I was like, where's Nish... Ni Nira. I keep wanting to call her Nishka, but no, that's someone from... Um... Neverwinter Nights 2. What do we got? Oh, it's just a core staff plus one. No big deal. Oh, and it's not usable by a monk. I, I thought monks could use them. Maybe only that's only in Neverwinter Nights. Or in Dungeon Dragons 3rd Edition. So I could have sworn they could. I mean, the, uh, quarter staves kind of suck. But I thought that they could use them. Yeah. Are you going to bless us? Okay. I'm, I wish you would have gotten a little closer before you cast that spell there. Um, <laughs> that was ridiculous how much effort it took to kill that wolf. That was laughable. That's why I laughed. Because it was laughable. Um, I want to kill this guy before you talk to us. What the hell? Okay, well that that's just dandy, Roger. I'm glad to hear that. I'm kind of under attack here, so chill. You got this coming! 
Come on. Finish him. There we go. Hey, Emma Wynn got a ding! Alright. It's not a very satisfying ding, though. It's just kind of a still tinkling sound. I care not. Well, I kind of care a little bit. And we're cl uh, close to one ding, anyway. Nice! Sweet. Well, I like that open lock stuff, so I'm going to stuff more in there. Because that seems really, really useful. I suppose, move silently, meh. You know, there's not much sneaking me to do when we can just kick ass. Pickpockets, nah. The, you might be able to get some really nice stuff with that, I'm sure, but you have to pick it from the right person. And we can just kill someone who's in that situation. This could be very important, but... Whatever, not not the moment. So I've decided anyway. Wow, she's actually level 3. Wow. Not bad, M1, not bad. How much more? Yeah, 5,000. So it is kind of staggered like that. Cool. Well, at least she's got some decent hit points. More than us, actually. Can't yeah, wait for us I'll to level right up because... <laughs> we, uh, we're kind of short on our points there, our hit points. Really be nice to have some more. Let's see what's over to the west. I think we gotta be pretty close to the coast. Can I go to either of those? Evidently, yes. Okay, move here, then turn around and go back. That's how I roll. Oh wait, I could've just gone to the other one from there. Duh. Should've done that. Top of my well, go. List. I'm pretty sure in like Planescape Torment and yeah, Air, right or, not, Air, in Arcanum and Fallout One and Two, I'm pretty sure only the main Top character has to get to list. a transition point in order to transition. Only one person has to do it. I guess the reason they did it differently here is because you can play this co-op multiplayer, which would be kind of cool, I guess. So they had to have the had to have the game mechanics in place so that everyone was along the same lines, you know. But I wish they would have done it differently in single player because if I want to go, I don't necessarily want to gather my party. I wish the game would just do that. And yes, you could kind of exploit it by having... We're walking... Oh. Is this a cliff? Or is it a... Or is it like a mountain? Because when you walk behind it like this, it looks like it's a mountain. But to me, it looks like a cliff. Yeah, and this shadow here is cast across it. That implies it's a cliff. So, a little, little bit of boo-boo there. But anyway, um, I wish that I'd be able to just transition, even if I, even if that would be a little bit of exploit, you know, because I could just have my one character run and get me out of any situation, kind of, but I'd have to make it there in order to do that. And, I don't know, I just wish you could, like other games. They just went for more realism, I guess, which is fine, I suppose, but it'd be nice if it gave a little bit of a break there. Ow. Well, at least they got some hit off. <laughs> it's ridiculous how much they miss. Well, not ridiculous, that's the wrong word, because I'm glad that they missed. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, but I got a critical miss? Shame on you, Randall. I expected more from you with your elite build that... The wonderful watchers recommended. For such extended... yeah. what top am I to do? Why do you get so sleepy all the time? <sighs> nah. Spells isn't as easy as I make it look. I'm tired. Uh, I see it's abandoned, but can I go inside? Evidently not. Okay. Oh, hello. Torlo. How's it going? You need something, stranger? Okay, well, you'd think that the big fight over there would have scared them away, or maybe the fact that there is dangerous undead all around and you're just standing here going fishing. A miner, huh? Aw, oh, poor guy. Well, I guess. What do you need? That's it? Hmm. Oh, he's a mine worker. Oh, yeah, yeah. As he yeah, said. I'll get right so I'm sure that. once we fix up the mines, we can come back and be like, Hey, dude, we got your job back. So you can go back into the deep, uh, dangerous mines and breathe in the, the dangerous dust and everything and have an early cancerous death. 
But at least it's your calling, right? Ew, pal. Denizens of the waters, huh? Okay, at least he's enjoying himself. No, no, I'm not going to say that. <laughs> kind of funny, though. Okay, how come all these are rude? What's the problem? He's enjoying himself fishing or something, so... I'll just say that. Optimistic, huh? Yeah, see, he didn't seem loony to me. Yeah, see, he's just fishing. So what's the problem that he's... Having a great time fishing. What's so weird about that? Doesn't seem weird to me. Some people like that. I mean, I don't like it, but... I know some other people do. Even without beer. Amazingly. Okay, well, storms... And all that stuff. Don't know how it affects us, but... Oh. Did we just get teleported over here? Or is this guy just look just like us? I don't know. Um, yeah, who are you? No, that he just looks a lot like us. That's all. Uh, Zekar, huh? Well, I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. Sorry, guy. Ooh. Ooh, uh-oh, uh-oh, she's poisoned. I wasn't expecting that. Uh-oh. Get back, get back. I believe you can't die from poison. Unless I just heard that from somewhere and it's inaccurate. Which is entirely possible, by the way. I'm gonna have her do with this. Why am I running? Oh, wow. Oh, wait, wait, why is he running? Is he afraid or something? What is that? What's that heart thing? Oh no, not him, him. Panic. Must be some spell. Wow. I really was not expecting trouble like this. Fair enough. Well, we'll just have to deal with it better next time. Every once in a while I... Forget I'm fleeing red wizards who want to open up my brain and study it, and I realize I'm having the time of my life. Aww, I'm glad to hear that, Nira. I'm glad you're here along with us, too. Uh, I'm not going to be too boastful, but I could. No, I'm not going to. I'm just going to be nice. Oh, I'm not. You sound awfully sure of yourself. I'm not going to be rude like that, but, uh... Oh, I'm going to do the romantic route. Aww, so cute. Unless it's, uh, unless I admit that, nah. Really? I feel the same way. Ever since we met on the road, I've begun feeling more and more like there's nothing I can't do. Well, that, that, then why are you standing alongside doing nothing so much of the time? <laughs> you know, with your four hit points and your one, and your one spell a day, not counting identify, you're not gonna exactly doing a whole lot. Just saying. Uh, yeah, set your mind to anything you want to do except for use a weapon properly because of your class. Thanks for the vote of confidence. I'll keep it in mind the next time I'm deciding whether to fight or run for my life. Was she being serious? I was sounding kind of snarky. Okay, well. well. I actually set your AI to make you run away, so... You know, don't get too many ideas there, because I don't exactly want you to stay and get yourself killed. That'd be annoying, because I'd have to reload, so please don't do that. Let's check out these boots. Boots of stealth, huh? Well, we can hand those on over to M.O.N. Here you go, M.O.N., maybe you'll stop failing at hiding in shadows now. I'm not exactly sure how boots help you hide in the shadows, but whatever. Not the point. See, I've got some more stuff here. Yeah, I should have her identify the Warhammer next. Ooh, and maybe the Gauntlets, too. Hell, I don't know why I even bother with her having any spells besides just identify. <laughs> I mean, she's basically just, uh, just our identifier, you know? You do not dream often, but tonight the visions are vivid indeed. 
Long have you walked, but now you find yourself back amidst the stones of Candlekeep. Your former home looms before you, but the gate is closed and barred. Over the walls there is a candle in your old room, but as the light goes out, the brick surrounding the window closes together. The very walls conspire to keep you at bay. A familiar voice startles you. Though it is calm and caring, you cannot go back this way, child. You must go on. Gorion forms before you. Though his image should be comforting, it seems but a shade of his living self. He is dead in your dreams, as in life. The phantom of your foster father gestures toward the blackness of the wood, as though it should be inviting. Perhaps it is, in a way, but the traveling will be hard. As you think this, a smooth and obvious path becomes clear out of the corner of your eye. It seems meant for you, pulls at your very being, and promises to quickly lead you away from the life you once led. Perhaps this would be for the best, but it is a bit too convenient for your liking. You do not wish to dwell upon the loss you have endured, but neither should it be forgotten. Gorion smiles and fades away. The pull becomes a push, but you turn away. Steadfast in your new direction, the way is not quite as clear, but it is sure to be interesting nonetheless. A whisper follows as you stride away, something vestigial and sinister that you recognize, but yet have never heard. You will learn. You don't look back. Well, that's interesting. Did something important happen there, or is this just scripted to happen after a certain amount of time? Ooh, I gained special ability. Sweet. Nice. Check. I want to see. I want to see. Special ability. Oh, that's just awesome. Sweet. Oh, I forgot I had charm animal. Nice. Okay. Stop that, everyone. It's kind of annoying when you go in and out of shadows all the time. Okay. Let's check out the identification of these things. What's a Ken Kensai? Must be like a monk. I don't know. So we got. Oh, it's cursed. Great. Uh huh. F Gloves of fumbling. Okay. Why would I possibly wa want that? I guess it's just like a punishment for if you don't identify things before you try using them, huh? How about this? Ooh, that looks nice. That sounds nice anyway. Wow. That sounds pretty cool. 1d4 1 D plus 3 plus 2 electrical. Is this two-handed? No, it is one-handed. So, why not? Hand it over. But not the backbiter. That would, that would suck. And this isn't cursed, right? No curse? Okay, no curse. But just in case, quick save. Oh, no, no, I want him. Okay, so I believe we've got our abilities in Morning Stars and Warhammers. Yep. All right. So it should be right up our alley. Seven hours of primary. How's that change? To hit minus four. That's a good thing, right? Yeah. yeah I think so. I think you want it as low as possible, right? Hmm. And how's the damage compare? 2d4, which would be potential max of 8, versus potential max of 7. Okay, that's not that great. But, you know what, I'll try it anyway. If for no other reason than because it can do electrical damage. So, once again, there's a chance of going 8, although the chance here should be more likely to go higher than if it was a 2d4, right? Right. Also, it's crushing, which is a contrast to, to my... Uh, oh, this is crushing too? Oh, I thought that I would have like some piercing damage or something. This actually requires more strength than this. That's funny, because this looks like that would take a lot more effort to wield than just a mace. But what do I know? How's the speed factor? Much faster, I think. I think. So, 
Whatever. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. Cool. Well, let's see how well all this stuff works. Where are you, boss? 